wine, Jen. I don't know how you got this assignment to talk to our good friends at Charlton Hobbs, but wine, I hear, is what you'll be talking about. That's right, uh, Bill. I've been looking forward to this uh, all morning, and consuming wine really has become more eco-friendly. Wasse Farm Family Estates has created an alternative to glass wine bottles using Tetra Packs and aluminum bottles, and they've been named Innovator of the Year by Wine Enthusiast Magazine, and Jean-Charles Wasse joins us to talk about eco smart packaging and to discuss the latest in organic wine. Thank you so much for being here and congratulations. It's a pleasure. Good morning, Jennifer. Where did this idea for this alternative packaging come about? Well, we started really farming our vineyards organically and biodynamically as well using the lunar calendar mm -hmm. and the stars in conjunction with the earth. And we realized that it was very, very important for our terroir and the quality of the wine to really respect the soil and the land and to be the stewards of the land. So then we thought, you know, uh, making wine organically was key and beyond that, really innovation and uh, or, you know, alternative packaging was the best way to minimize carbon footprints as well. How much of a difference does this kind of packaging make? How does it reduce that carbon footprint? Well, very dramatic. There's a rule which is what we call the 70% rule where, you know, consumers typically buy wine and drink it very quickly. So this minimizes it by more than 70% uh, altogether as far as the carbon footprint emission and their CO2 uh, exposition to the world. Okay, now we've got uh, several different bo um, packages here. Let's talk about them. We've got uh, the Tetra Packs and then the aluminum bottles yes, as well. so the benefit of this one is fantastic in terms of transportation and the entire supply chain okay. and the convenience of it. So there's three key aspects. Value for the consumer, this is one liter for the same price of a 750 ml. So there's seven glasses of wine instead of five. Number two, it's very convenient. As you can see, it's very light. That's right. And this it's is the French Rabbit Pinot Noir. Very, very, very soft on the feel, so yeah. very, very sensual. Well, and this is really interesting because once upon a time, wine in boxes wasn't uh, meant to be so chic, but now it's environmentally chic. Indeed, very much. We've put that's the first vintage wine, as you could see, in a Chetra pack. Mm -hmm. uh, very easy and convenient. I think we need to try it together. <laughs> Although it's that's early me. in the morning, we still need to have a toast. It's much better than coffee. Sounds good to me. And as you could see, there's never any cork it's very easy to serve, salty. Cheers. Happy New Year. Yes. Mm. And it's very fresh, very crisp. Very delicate as well on the mm -hmm. palate. Very easy to close. And the beauty of what we call it French Rabbit is you see the ears. Let's say we drink half of it today. Uh, <laughs> half of I the don't know if half <laughs> of it will be around, actually. But <laughs> <laughs> yes. So you could squeeze your rabbit. You show your rabbit some affection. Okay. You take the entire air off. You close it back, and you put it back in your fridge. And you can keep the wine for more than a week. Oh, that's great. So not only yeah. this is great from the ecological standpoint, but as well for the convenience, because you can preserve wine longer. So that's a great innovation to the benefit of the environment and the consumer, more now, importantly. Now we only have about 30 seconds left, but what about this bottle? Let's talk about this bottle of wine here. It's in, it's in an aluminum. That's right, packaging. so the beauty of it, it's much lighter as well to transport. It's uh, refreshed very fast. In a matter of 10 minutes, you can bring it cold to temperature. And we've put a very cool little dot as you yes. can see here. Chill me, it says. So whenever that turns blue, this is the right temperature to drink it. So we thought it was important for consumers as well to know when a wine was appropriately uh, drinkable. And she's very, very cool, very sexy, <laughs> and this is the new generation of wine. Perfect, and this just makes it very easy. Thank you so much. It's Jean a pleasure. For Thank you for having us. And congratulations again. Merci beaucoup. Jean-Charles Wasse is the president of Wasse Farm Family and States, and we will thank him again for joining us. Coming up, though, Sarah Lynn will be here with the latest Hollywood headlines in The Scoop. She'll have the latest on Brangelina and their date with Oscar. Stay with us. It's 8.51.